gonna make some hummus. Um, tin of uh, chickpeas in there. Uh huh? All right, sorry about that, I'm back. Um, one tin of chickpeas in there. Uh, this can be, it doesn't have to go in a, in a whizzer like this, but I've decided to make it really smooth today. Um, sometimes I do it with a stick blender and leave it a bit grainy, which is nice. But, um, but no, today I'm gonna make it smooth. So one lemon going in there and I'm using a sieve to catch the pips because you know, it's one method of doing it. And some water, which isn't, isn't chickpea water, I just use the can to, to carry it. Some olive oil, just extra virgin olive oil for the flavor. I'm just going with that, uh, just feeling it as usual. Some tahini, now this is dark tahini, which I wouldn't normally use I would use light but I'm running low on my light and it's such a nice one the light one that I've got such a nice make that I want to save it um for drizzling over things because it's just so tasty um garlic cloves I don't think I'm gonna bother chopping them up or anything I'm just gonna trust that they will that was like a smallish one and a very small one so i.e. like one big fat one. Salt, quite a bit of salt. In my experience, you need quite a bit. Some smoked paprika, paprika, sorry, because why not? Like hummus can carry different flavors. Some cumin, oh, I put way too much, way too much in there. I think I've got a cold. So um, I was gonna say, maybe that's why I'm a bit, uh, but I think no more than usual. But the garlic will be good for the cold. Um, yeah, I think that's good. Let me wash my hand behind you. And we will put this onto Wiz. Now, I'm gonna, oh, lemon pip in my jumper. I'm gonna whiz it up and um, then taste it. So I stopped it because I thought it looked like it was struggling and. It looks actually perfect, but let's taste. It's really good. I'm gonna add a bit more salt though, and a bit more water because even though it looks like the perfect texture, when the hummus is in the fridge, it will um, firm up a bit more. So you kind of want it to look a bit more runny than it should do. Flavour's really good though. In fact, I might add a bit more olive oil as well because the flavour of olive oil in hummus is really nice. Okay, let's give it another whiz. Right, that's done. I think it's a, a great texture. Ooh, look at that, lovely. It's sort of pouring in, pouring into the bowl. really nice I'll get the rest out of that later you could always let's do it let's not just talk about it dust a bit of whoop paprika and drizzle a little olive oil beautiful beautiful hummus Lovely, very comforting. And it's still warm actually. Mmm, mmm, taste of paprika. See, I could just scoop and scoop and scoop. It's a nice thing for a Saturday. Hope you have a good day. Like and subscribe if you want to.